Again, wonderful question. From an interior point of an equilateral triangle, perpendiculars are drawn on all three sides. The sum of the lengths of the three perpendiculars is S, and the area of the triangle is. And so, there's one funda that you should know, but I'm going to assume we don't know that. We'll start from there. And so, take a point here, dropping a perpendicular, dropping a perpendicular, dropping a perpendicular. And so, you drop a perpendicular to three. What will these three add up to? The question is saying the sum of those three is a constant for an equilateral triangle. Right? Now, one thing is to prove that it will be a constant. The other thing from an exam point of view is to say, okay, I'm going to figure out a point such that it's easy to calculate this. What will I do? I'll not select a point on the interior. I'll select this point. From this point, I'll drop a perpendicular here. From this point, I need to drop a perpendicular to that line. Nothing, just a point. This point, perpendicular to this line, just a point. So those two don't add too much or the total, nothing but the altitude. See if you can prove this. From any point on the interior of an equilateral triangle, if you drop three perpendicular to the three sides, the sum of those three perpendiculars will add up to the altitude of the equilateral triangle. And not rocket science, very easily provable. See if you can prove it. But from an exam point of view, you don't need to do that. Pick one point, you're good to go. Or you could have picked the centroid or, or ortho center or circum center, they're all coincident. From that point, you could have assumed and then done this, or you'll always come back to this. This question effectively is saying S is root 3 by 2a. Done. So the sum of all this is root 3a by 2. Or a is 2s by root 3. Area of the equilateral triangle is root 3 by 4 a square that you should know. So therefore area is root 3 by 4 into 2s by root 3 into 2s by root 3. 1 root 3 gets knocked off. 2 into 2 is 4 s square by root 3. Yeah, luckily we have that good to go. And the sum of the three altitudes, sum of the three perpendiculars will be equal to the altitude of the equilateral triangle. That's one funda that you should know. After that, we're just plugging in the formula. Thank you.